stomach cancer is the second leading cause for cancer mortality. And many of the stomach cancer patients need to receive surgical removal as the treatment. What does that mean? A small portion of your stomach or even most of the stomach need to be cut off from your body. And then new tissue will regenerate in the original site to re restore the normal function of your body. But this process may be very hard and time consuming as the tissues in our human bodies are very complex with multi-layered structure. And also another major problem is that the, uh, the recurrence rate of the cancer after surgery is very high. It may range from 20% or even 80% after surgery. So these are the challenges the research is facing now. Then I ask myself, can I build up one single system to combine the tissue regeneration and also the recurrence cancer detection and treatment together at the same time? This is an entirely new idea, new approach, and no one has done this before. Now comes to the question, could this be possible? Then I tried it, and it was wonderful. This is what I got. I designed a tiny medical device. Cells and gold nanoparticles were put inside microspheres and then distributed in three-dimensional structured materials. This is also called scaffolds. Then, when during the surgery, the stomach tumor was removed outside the patient's body, this tiny device was subsequently put inside the original tumor site. And then these three components, scaffolds, cells, and growth factors, would work together to accelerate the formation of the new tissue. The scaffolds would degrade inside the patient's body and disappear eventually. Just like putting salt into the water, they will all disappear. Then the gold nanoparticles show the red color here. They could specifically target cancer cell, the blue color, and then provide signals for the cancer detection outside the patient's body. Meanwhile, when there is a laser light covers the cancer cell's area, these cancer cells would die. And if the laser light can cover all the areas, all the cancer cells could die, and more importantly, the healthy cells would not be affected because they are not targeted by these nanoparticles. So to conclude, I would suggest that this novel medical device could be used for post-surgery cancer patients. And more importantly, this method is not only restricted to the stomach cancer, it can also be conducted with other, like the brain cancer or brain cancer or the lung cancer. And that is my ambition, to save cancer patients, save their families. Thank you.